Hello, my name is Wojciech Maruszek. I'm Solution Architect at Alibaba Cloud. In today's video, I would like to show you how to import and export ECS images in Alibaba Cloud. Without further ado, let's start it. First of all, what is ECS image? ECS image is a snapshot of existing virtual machine at certain point in time. It includes the operating system and the data of that ECS. First of all, image import and export must be whitelisted on a user account. Simply open a ticket with Alibaba Cloud support. So why do we need import and export of the ECS image? First of all, we can copy the existing ECS image between the regions. Let's say, for example, you have an image in Frankfurt region and you would like to copy it to the US region. We can as well share our images with the different Alibaba Cloud accounts. For example, you have a, another customer you would like to share your prepared ECS image. You can, in a few clicks, do it. We can as well create more ECS instances with exact same configuration. Very useful in auto-scaling scenarios. We can as well create a repository of ECS images for a backup and disaster recovery. We can as well import our existing virtual machines into Alibaba Cloud. We can as well import virtual machines into Alibaba Cloud. And at the very end, we can export the virtual machine from Alibaba Cloud. In today's demo, I would like to show you uh, how can we copy the image to other Alibaba Cloud region? How can we share the image with other Alibaba Cloud account? How can we export virtual machine? And how can we import custom virtual machine? So without further ado, let's start it. Okay, I'm logged in into my Alibaba Cloud account. So how do we create the ECS image? It's very simple. In the instances, choose the desired instance, click on the on its ID, and in the basic information section, click Create Custom Image. As I mentioned a few minutes ago, the image creation is based on a snapshot. We have to create a snapshot first. Let's give it the custom image name. And let's hit create. It may take several minutes to create the ECS image. I will pause the video and return back to you once it's finished. Okay, our image was successfully created. Let's get back to our use cases. First of all, let's copy the image to the other region. As you see, I'm in the Frankfurt region Let's copy it to the United States. On the desired ECS image, click Copy Image. Choose the target region. Let's copy it to US. We have to provide the custom image name. And let's hit OK. If we switch to the Virginia region, we see that the image is being created. OK, our image is copied to the Virginia region in US. So what can we do now with the copied image? 
it's quite simple. We can either create an instance from it, we can share the image. Okay, our image is copied to the Virginia region. Now we can try and create an instance from our image. Click Create Instance. And we see that the custom image is already selected. I will fast forward the virtual machine creation. Okay, our virtual machine is up and running. And let's try to log in. It works. Let's go back to the Frankfurt region. So I showed you so far how can we create an ECS image? How can we copy the image to another region? Now let's share it with other Alibaba Cloud account. In order to do it, we just need the Alibaba Cloud account ID. Let me just copy it. Let's go back to the web browser and let's click share image. What we have to provide here is our account ID and simply click share image. It's done. Let's switch back to the second account and see if the image is visible. Let's hit refresh and let's go to the share image tab. As you see, it's exactly the same image we just shared. So it's working. Okay, now we will export our image to object storage in Alibaba Cloud, which is called OSS. In order to do it, first we have to create the OSS bucket. In the OSS console, let's create a bucket. Let's choose the Frankfurt region and hit OK. Select the image export demo or your ECS image, hit export image. We have to provide the OSS bucket and the prefix name. The image export task has been successfully submitted. It may take a few minutes to export it to object storage. In the object storage, we can see that the fragments are being sent. Exported image can be converted to um, any format you want and then reused again in your environment. The last part of our video is the importing custom image. Alibaba Cloud supports several image formats. It's RAW, VHD, and KVM images. I prepared in advance an image which is already uploaded to the OSS bucket. Let's import it to our account. Select import image, and we have to provide the OSS object address. How can we get it? Let's go back to the OSS management console. Choose the bucket with the images. Let's choose the ECS image URL. And let's paste it in the OSS object address. Again, we have to provide the, the image name. Besides the certain types of the images, as I mentioned, RAW, BHD, and KVM, customers are free to import 
Linux and Windows OSs. Alibaba Cloud supports following Linux images. CentOS, Ubuntu, CoreOS, Alium, Debian, SUSE, OpenSUSE, FreeBSD, Red Hat, and other Linuxes. From the Windows part, we support the versions from 2003, 2008, 2012, 2016. We have to provide uh, disk size, choose the correct platform. In my case, it's a uh, Ubuntu and the image format. Click OK. And the image import tasks will be started. It might take several minutes to finish. OK, so our image is imp successfully imported. Meanwhile, let's check the exported image. It's here as well, so everything works as designed. So I would like to thank you for your time, and I wish you a very good day.